On this episode of Searching for History, we are taking a look at Germany. This time, we are going to show you the truly amazing town of Meissen. Meissen is located on the Elbe River, about 15 miles northwest of Dresden. Dresden, the capital of Saxony, is a beautiful city, very much worth a visit. However, for this video, we are going to focus on Meissen. Meissen is about 1,000 years old and is famous for the manufacture of Meissen porcelain. Aaron and I came here for Meissen's picturesque beauty and its small town charm. Another thing to consider, Meissen makes a great base for a day trip into Dresden by taking the S-Bahn. Stay in Meissen, day trip into Dresden. The green line you see here on this map is the S-Bahn route. It took somewhere between 30 and 40 minutes to go from Meissen to the center of Dresden. I will be honest, seeing the Castle Cathedral complex overlooking the town in an aerial photograph is what really brought us to Meissen. Here we are looking west across the Elbe River at Meissen's old town. Albrechtsburg is the castle complex up on the right. Seeing the Albrechtsburg really was a highlight of our time visiting Saxony and the Elbe River Valley. On your walk through the old town to the castle, you will pass through the marked plots. Don't miss the chance to sit down, marvel at the beauty of the town square, and drink some beer. After walking through the marked plots, you turn the corner and start the ascent up the Burgstrasse with its many shops. The stairway you see here on the left is the quickest way to go from street level up to the castle. When you reach the top of the stairs and turn to the right, you see the entrance to the Albrechtsburg. In the middle of the inner castle sits the Dom zu Meissen. The Meissen porcelain factory is on the left. The residential part of the castle sits behind and to the left of the cathedral. What you see here is the entrance to the castle residence. The interior of the castle is extremely beautiful. The following is a sample of what you will see when visiting. This room is a gallery of the former rulers of Saxony. I will point out that this artwork isn't medieval. It is too lifelike. Medieval art is graphically simple. The artwork you are seeing in this room is from the 19th century or later. I am not sure which king this is, but the rich colors and the quality of the work is beautiful. I love the gothic arches and the tiled floor of this room. This view is from a terrace on the river side of the cathedral looking out over the Elbe River and Meissen's new town. Okay, Aaron. The next and final part of Meissen we will show you is the inside of the cathedral, Dom zu Meissen. The Meissen Cathedral is located on the Castle Hill overlooking the town of Meissen, Germany. This cathedral replaced an older Romanesque church at the same location. The cathedral was built between 1260 
and 1410 in the Gothic style. The cathedral switched from Catholic to Lutheran during the Protestant Reformation in 1581. This area of the cathedral we are in is the nave, the main part of the cathedral. You can see the pointed arches typical of the Gothic style. The altarpiece you see here in the nave is by Lucas Cranach the Elder, a German Renaissance painter famous for his works during the Northern Renaissance. This area of the cathedral we are now entering is called the High Choir. The sculptures you see on either side near the altarpiece are by the Naumburg Master, an anonymous medieval stone sculptor famous for his works during the 13th century. The high choir altarpiece is Flemish, Northern Renaissance, but beyond that I was not able to find any information about the painter. <laughs> 